What's up, Basic Squad? It's your favorite basic girl, Iris Nicole. And as always, hey, I'm glad to see your basic too. And if you're new to my channel, hey, how are you? I'm Iris Nicole. But as y'all can see from the title of the video, your girl's going apartment hunting. She is moving to Dallas. If you haven't watched my video, I'm going to go ahead and put her in the card so you can go ahead and watch it. But y'all already know, if you like this type of content, go ahead and hit that like button. If you like your girl, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. This is our largest 777 square foot home. Would you be bringing a washing dryer? I will not. So what does it have to rent one? Yes, yeah, so we have $40. They will all be Samsung front loads. Okay. I do like that. I like the island. And you said this is the larger one, correct? Yes, this is the 777 square foot. Okay, and it has a tub. Oh, wow. Okay. The <laughs> shower. I do like the closet. And you know what size bed this is? That's a queen. It's a queen size bed? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, I do like it. Yes. Now, all of our units are the same uh, as far as the appliances. Austin is still appliances, the same thing, uh, fixtures throughout. Mm -hmm. The only difference is, is that if you're in an odd uh, number building, it will be this color combination. Okay. If you're in an even number building, the floor cabinet colors will switch. The uh, countertop will be gray and the backsplash will be white. It would be gray. Okay, and there's a little storage out here. That's nice. Oh, that's the hot water. Mm -hmm. I really like the full size washer and dryer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I do like this space as well, yeah. too. Yeah. It's a great enough. Yeah, I went as well. And then you have a pantry. Mm -hmm. You do some more tools there. Yeah. You can mount your TV if you feel. We're on the fourth floor. On the third floor, you have the white cabinets. I do like this those. one, too, actually. Yeah. I'm not opposed to any of them, actually. Okay, so same sort of bathroom set up here. Okay. And you said this is the studio? Yes, this is the studio for nine ninety seven. Okay. And then the closet's right there. Okay, I do like this. So no key fob, just the actual pad itself. Exactly. Okay, I do like this. Yeah. So this is the open concept one, so this is just yes. extra storage. I do like that. And this is, oh, that's not it. And then the bathroom straight ahead of me. And the lights are on the left and right. On the left. Okay, so it's a combining one. This is cool. I like the tub. I like the closet space. Oh, and that's a linen closet. Yeah. And then like this that. is the wash and dryer. Oh, wow, the full size. Okay. Mm -hmm. I do like that. And your living room and your bedroom through there with the walk-in closet in the bedroom. Okay, I like the built-ins. Okay, so is this one exactly that would be available? Yes. And what do you know is square footage on this? Five seven inches. Oh, I do like this a lot. Yeah. <laughs> a lot and this is just a pantry? pantry? Yeah. So you'll have a pantry, you'll have a little um a linen closet. You'll have bigger versions of everything, especially too. Because this is six ninety one square feet and you picked a nine thirty eight square feet. Well, I like that. I like that one, mate. Yeah. And a bigger bedroom. You'll have two sinks and. Um, I like this bathroom floor. Yeah. That's kind of what really got me. It's just different. Yeah. It's not your typical. Yeah. And you'll have like a double the size for the living closet. 
Mm -hmm. I like the built in, see that? Okay. I do like this a lot. It's spacious. And so does it all come with the Jack and or the Juliet yeah. balcony? Okay. Hmm. And is this, do you know what's, is that a king bed? Yes. It is, okay. I like this a lot actually. Okay. And they all come standard with the standby. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah, so this is a different form. Okay. I mm -hmm. actually really like this cabinet shape too. And this would be the washing dryer. Okay, that's nice. Mm -hmm. And then it comes with the actual Juliet as well. I try not to get you. <laughs> I like the window. It's nice. As I posted a video, I did also realize that I did not um, kind of explain why some of them aren't in person. So I actually looked at the ones that were like on the computer first and then I went to Dallas and actually looked at the other apartments. I just put them in reverse. I don't know why I did that, but you. So I do like the cabinets. I do like the floors a lot too. But this living room is kind of tiny. I'm the type of person, I will definitely sacrifice my bedroom space for the living room. And at this point, I'm not liking this one. Like, I like the cool tone-ness of it. I love the light, cap, the light floors. I love the cement walls. I think that's really, really cute. Bathroom's really, really dark. I like the deep tub. I like that there's somewhere I can put my products in there in the shower. I like the mirror. And I love the windows. But yeah, see this bedroom space? Uh, it's not even that. It's bigger than actual living room space. And I don't really like that. I would much rather prefer living room space than bedroom space. Because I'm more often than not, I will most likely be on the couch. It's a decent sized closet. So I'm not opposed to that. Let's try a different floor plan. Okay, so it's still a one bedroom, just a little bit bigger. I like the mud area. Again, I love these floors and the white walls. I love that it's a gas stove. Ugh, I love that. I love the farm sink. I love the cement. I love that. The windows. This one's a lot bigger than the previous one, but I don't like this enclosed space here. I want to be able to put my TV and let it just be free. I don't like it being in that little enclosed space because I feel like I'm obligated to use that space. But interesting. So on the wall, it has a place for you to put the TV, but then it has this extra cubby space back here. I don't know how I feel about that. Because what would I put back here? Hmm. Interesting. I like the island. Okay, this bedroom is kind of spacious. I love that it has the actual balcony off of the bedroom. Okay, so that other door was actually to connect to the bathroom. Okay, so it's the same type of bathroom setup. Now, let's see if it's going to show me the closet or not. It's not going to show me the closet. If you know me, I do need some closet space. So. I don't like that at all.
Is this supposed to be the den area? Oh, I don't like this. Hmm, okay, that's the front, okay, that's the front door. I love, again, the gas stove. I love the cabinets. I love the marble, too. The island with the wine fridge is gorgeous. Is this the washing machine and dryer? Oh, it's a closet. Okay. So this would be the washing machine and dryer. Yeah, okay. I love the windows. The living rooms is it's a decent size. I love that there's cabinetry right here. I think that's really, really cute. The bedroom's also a decent size. Again, I love the windows. Okay, this is where you lost me because why didn't you keep the same cabinetry from the kitchen going on in there? I don't I don't really like that. I love the deep tub. I love the rainfall shower. The moment of truth. Okay, it's a pretty spacious closet. So this one's alright. I'm not really opposed. The only thing I don't like would be the actual bathroom cabinetry, but that's something that, again you can live with. Like I told y'all, I don't mind sacrificing the bedroom space for the living room space so i think this is actually okay and i do like the actual double door refrigerator same cabinetry going on i like the fact that it still has an island here it's a long hallway leading into the kitchen i i'm confused about the living room space this one's just configured a little too weird and i wouldn't know how to actually style this like i could have like a dining room table here but then my living room would be tiny, and I don't like that at all. I like this little standoff window, though. I think that's cool. And I like that everything is actually either laminate or whatever, but there's no carpet. I like that, too. It has a little window thingy in the bedroom, too. I think that's really, really cute. Closet is definitely spacious, which I need. And again, with the bathroom, I don't understand why they're so weird to me. But again, it's just the bathroom. I like it. And I like the fact that it has a mud area. I didn't even see that. I thought you really nice. I like the square footage. All right, so that's the front door. Okay, so within this space, there is like a little den. Or, that's cool. I like the industrial look of it. This is definitely big enough for me to put like a desk and even like a couch or a chair if I wanted to. Okay. This is just another den area, hangout area. I can even do like a chair or desk there too. Oh, okay, that's the kitchen. I like the fact that it has a water dispenser. I like the double doors. It does have a glass top, which I'm not really happy about, but I do like everything else. I really would need this big of an actual table though. Hmm. It's it's fairly small for it to be the square footage that it is. Which I think is weird. But alright. I like how the bedroom is decked off in the corner though. For it to be a studio, I do like that. You don't have to worry about if I wanted to I could fucking curtain up. I like the garden tub. Okay, it's a decent bathroom. I love that it has the full-size washer and dryer. I love that they're side-by-side side and not stackable. This closet, though, is looking really, really tiny, and I don't know if that's going to work with all my clothes. Okay, just walking in, I can already tell. Hmm, I could work with this. I like that it kind of has a design already, so I can kind of, like, map out my floor plan. I would definitely do like a smaller table back here. Okay. Or even no table at all. I can just put like an island up here. Or a bar counter and some stools. I don't like the stove very much. But I do like the refrigerator. I like all the pantry space that it gives too. Okay, the views are great. I like that, that even though the windows are small, you can still get the impact of the view. Oh, it has a half bathroom. 
That's different. Oh wow, and it's mirrored. I think that's cute. That's cool. I like the idea of the, the touch of that. The bedroom's a decent size. Okay, so just a normal shower and bathroom. Okay, the washing dryer is in the closet. This is not in the closet space for me. The front door. Okay, this is the front door. Same kitchen. I do still like the actual layout of that. I like the two tone cabinets. I don't know about this, but it's like a black shiny, but it's like a mirror. I don't know. That's weird. I think it's different, but I like it. I don't know if this would be the living room space or what is this? Is this the bedroom? No. So is this the living room space? Oh, so it's a, is it a den? Okay. I like that it has this. I think that's cool. Yeah, I like the windows. If I wanted to probably make this the living room, I think it's a great size for that. 